in patients who have um, who have um, early or who have early um, evidence of metastatic disease, early docetaxel substantially improves survival, and uh, there is no question about this. Um, the survival gains that we've made in recent years with many of the new drugs um, are, are minuscule in comparison to going uh, to treating patients with docetaxel up front. You know, we, one of the things I think that happens as we wait for a more obvious progression or truly uh, refractory, hormone refractory patients, patients often have um, performance status that precludes treatment or another complication of chemotherapy and they never get to the most active agents. Um, so I think this is important. This has huge implications on American practice though. So many patients who have early stage prostate cancer are treated by their urologists only with, um, with hormone suppression. And so this is going to change how we look at these, this huge group of patients, whether all patients with a prostate cancer diagnosis, even if we didn't traditionally think that they had visceral disease or were ready for chemotherapy, almost all patients with prostate cancer at relapse need to see an oncologist and have the conversation. They may elect to hold off on chemotherapy, um, but we really need to rethink uh, what we do for this group of patients. So I think that to this trial, to me, is a game changer. Um, it, cha it absolutely changes who cares for these patients early in their disease and what we do with them.